You know those people who claim they can get by on less than six hours of sleep a night? Turns out a few of them might be onto something, and we mean a few. They never use an alarm clock, they rarely yawn, don't need caffeine, and no naps. NPR reports so-called short sleepers make up a very small percentage of the population. If you think you're one, you're probably kidding yourself. With just five or six hours sleep, they're more energized than regular sleepers. And less sleep isn't hurting these short sleepers. They are very active, they're very optimistic. They're go-getters. A husband and wife team of scientists at the University of California, San Francisco is studying the genetics of sleep and short sleepers. Dr. Ying Hui Fu has discovered less than 1% of the population is biologically capable of comfortably running on six hours of sleep or less. And biologically capable is the catch. It's a genetic mutation. So is the amount of sleep we naturally need hardwired into our bodies or can we learn sleep patterns? It's largely genetic, okay. that's what researchers are finding. According to CNN, Fu's lab has only found 20 to 30 people with the genetic mutation that allows them to get by on less sleep. Fu told CNN it's hard to tell how frequent this mutation is. But with time and research, there might one day be a drug that changes the circadian rhythm or internal clock that controls sleep. Fu's husband, Dr. Louis Patachik, also studies sleep patterns. He focuses on circadian rhythms. Patachik told the Wall Street Journal he hopes to begin testing drugs that will alter circadian rhythms. These drugs might eventually treat jet lag and enhance chemotherapy treatments. Fu hopes to find a drug that's better than caffeine at reducing the amount of sleep needed. But it'll be a while before these sleep-related drugs are available, so if you're hoping for something to ease that jet lag, clocking a solid eight hours of sleep might be your best bet. For Newsy, I'm Katherine Beek.